Hello everyone, this is Stefan. Welcome back for another video. So in today's video, I'll show you my settings for the Logitech G29. So let me show you some of the settings that I use with the wheel. So you can apply the same settings or you can change some settings. If this doesn't work, let me know in the comments down below. So let's not waste time let's go to the option and uh, let's go to controls so first of all with the controls uh, I didn't change anything from here the only thing I changed is the camera inverted vertical this is on and the second thing that they changed is the camera inverted horizontal so this is on as well so only the camera options uh, hor horizontal and vertical on so this needs to be on uh, and let's go to the button mapping as you can see this is my settings so obviously steering left right um, obviously this is, uh, if you use uh, the DualSense controller, but pretty much the same settings are applied for the wheel as well. As you can see, you can map everything, you can watch this video, and you can pretty much do the same. Okay, let's go to controls. As you can see, this actually is for the DualSense controller. But if I go back, and now my uh, Logitech G29 is connected. So if you go back to the settings now, as we can see, we have the steering wheel. Let's go to the steering wheel. And this is pretty much everything that obviously you can take photos, but this is going to be in your steering wheel settings. And um, you can apply the same uh, options actually, which is pretty cool. Uh, and if we go back to the controls, uh, the button mapping, again, you can do pretty much the same that what I did. And I will show you right now in the gameplay. Okay, so let me show you the settings now. So at least you can see the wheel. Uh, the only thing that I hope they can do something about it will be nice. I don't think they're gonna the, the, the people that make made this game. I don't think they, they watch this. They're gonna watch this video, but it will be nice if there's gonna be an update that we can use our shifter. That will be much much better, I think. Uh, also, there's no options to use um, the gears for some reason. But yeah, let me show you now all the settings uh, that this is pretty well made for the Logitech G29 so let's play now and as you can see um, this is gonna work pretty well right now because all the buttons are already mapped and actually this is gonna be very very nice now because most of the games actually the mapping is not very well so as we can see we can move left and right this is pretty decent pretty good actually so also if you press the r3 on the steering wheel see we can change the camera This is pretty nice. Again, this is very helpful when you uh, when you are in a junction 
and uh, let's say uh, you want to see if any vehicles are coming from left on right this is pretty good we have the uh, pretty much everything set up let me show you now so I changed some of the buttons so L3 is how we start the engine also if you press the circle we have additional menu here so for example I want to turn my lights on as you can see the lights are on also the indicators also I change the indicators so because we don't have a gears um, up and down so basically I change the indicators on the steering wheels so basically this is right and this is left so basically I use the pedals here because this is much much easy to use and I'll show you right now let's drive obviously we're not gonna get a job now just to show you that this actually is working pretty well but again I wish they can implement um, the shifter that will be nice and also the engine the sound of the engine is not very well made if I'm honest with you as we can see the camera works pretty well and we can turn now there's no any vehicles coming so the settings actually pretty good uh, no complaints whatsoever about the settings um, I'm gonna go here I'm gonna do U-turn here oop, oop, no actually this was bad <laughs> uh, but yeah everything works as supposed to work which again this is very good um, this is very good actually oop, I didn't see that stay there uh, this works very well so ooh because I have problems to set up the settings uh, with the bus 21 for some reason any vehicles are coming no uh, but as you can see this works pretty pretty well um, oops uh, no problems oh boy I'm so fast uh, no problems whatsoever this is working pretty pretty well as you can see so all the settings from the circle also this is the horn if you press uh, R2 is your missions your skills if you press the L2 is your mapping so if you, if you want to see your map which is pretty nice and again the R3 is the camera and we can switch the engine from uh, L3 so there we have it guys if you have any questions please leave it in the comments down below this was the settings with the Logitech G29 if this video is helpful please make sure to subscribe turn your bell notifications and I'll see you in the next video